Hey, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be reacting to Motherland Fort Salem Season 5. Nope, that's not right. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to be reacting to Motherland Fort Salem Season 2, Episode 5. We're halfway there of the show. And oh my god, so much is going on right now. Rio and Scylla saw each other for the first time after a year for us, but probably like weeks for them. Tally is about to confront Alda. And Abigail... <laughs> Poor, people need to leave Abigail alone. Poor thing's been attacked. Her cousin died. She lost her boyfriend. She's only seen as a breeding machine. Poor thing is not having a good time, man. <laughs> Last year, for for season one, for half of it, we got Rayla. We, we got we got the whole cake. And for season two, five episodes in, we only got them, you know, seeing each other again. So it's a, a very different thing from last year. Last season. So we're getting crumbs now. That's what I'm saying. We're getting crumbs now, but we we. <laughs> I heard that we're getting a reunion in episode seven. I don't know if that's true, but we're two episodes away now, and I'm I'm not ready. <laughs> okay, let's start. Oh, they look so good. She's trying to get them to stay at, in her country. Oh god, I hope nothing happens. This sounds- this looks like it's gonna- something's gonna happen. Oh shit. Oh fuck! Oh that's bad, that's- Oh no, General Sharma! Oh no, oh no. That- Oh my god. Man, they upgraded season two! Well, I did not expect that was what a what 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 an opening. Do you like Sedalia music? Okay. <laughs> Where did you hear about Nick to the Ten? I know she personally served under you in Liberia during the martyrdom. I wasn't in Liberia at the time, Kata. Liar. She can redact photographs and edit history books. But I know you were there with her. Telly was. She's trying to set the mood, but it's not working. The loss of and her rebels is one of my deepest regrets. So I cover up Nicta. She deserted shortly after witnessing what Estabrook and her followers did to themselves. We all have our prideful failings. Your belief that you can barge in here, in the dead of the night, no less, to make accusations of conspiracy and nefarious intent against me. I just wanted answers. And what makes you think you are owed any? We are connected. The time has passed. No, they're still connected. Then why have I been seeing these memories? Ever since the surgery, I thought they were dreams at first. Does Isadora give you something to make sure that the connection is well and truly severed? I'm surprised. I guess Tally's the first one that's ever been offered, that ever gave herself up to be a biddy, and then Everything to be able to unbiddy. Well, someone has to have experience the same that she has, I guess. Her mom at the testing center. Is Bellwether okay? Yeah, her mom's checking on her now. Did you know that Scylla escaped from custody? Oh, <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Why would I know anything about that? Maybe because you're the last soldier to see her before she was allegedly shipped off to jail. I saw her. At the riot. Where I found this. No! Oh. So unless this is another spree agent trying to screw with my head aware. That Rams one is no longer in custody, and yes, she was on site yesterday. And how long have we known that she's on the loose? <gasps> is that as much of an answer as you're gonna give me? That's as much as I can, yes. She looks so sad. I said more than I should, actually. Alex. Did she get this? Oh, right. But she, but she, what? I'm sorry, Carla. Can't I think knows that Rayel's mom's alive, right? Funny. It's Justine. I was just wondering about this Halloween party. Man. Are we supposed to wear costumes? Or... Amalia! Jonas, wait. Okay, Gracie, Saturday. Jonas, so good. it's a suicide mission. 
Yeah. The Camarilla are picking us I'm off. I'm not here for the Camarilla. I'm here to change things so that our people can stop fighting their wars. You think throwing your life away is going to change that? <laughs> you know, out of everyone, I thought you'd understand. You used to be a wild animal. Now you're just soft, ineffective, weak. He's not weak. There are things worth dying for. And there are things worth living for. Yes! There's always a choice. Preach. I really like her hair this season. It was so good. No, Abigail. Poor thing! We're looking for the Camry that escaped. Look harder. <laughs> you think we aren't? You and Alder told everyone it was the spree. But it wasn't the spree that attacked me. It wasn't the spree that tried to cut out my throat. It was the Camarilla. They came after me just like they did Shermel. Oh. Except you survived. Twice, in fact. Don't you say that? Excuse me? I wouldn't expect you to understand. Because you weren't stupid enough to walk into their trap. No, oh, she feels... She, she keeps... I still can't get the stuff that Zadora gave me out of my mouth. Ooh. Well, at least you can get a good night's sleep, right? You know, part of me didn't want to take it. Another part just desperately wanted peace from all of this. All there is until telling the whole truth. Well, do you know that for sure? I saw what happened, right? What's with the tables? Oh, it's really dumb supper tonight. Or what? A salad. You eat the meal backwards in complete silence. Dessert first. Oh, and okay. With the black chairs. For the dead to join in. Can you do it else? Considering I almost got my throat cut out again, doing great. Uh, no, I was, I was talking about India. She doesn't know. I'm she doesn't sorry, know. I, I thought you'd heard. There was a Camarilla attack on a government train. That's where I do it went. Right? For fuck's sake. Perhaps, back again. It's all for the news. Public blame on the Camarilla. Oh, okay. Not the spree. So much for the Hague agreeing to keep things quiet. It's only a matter of time. But now that we have these tapes, the Camarilla can no longer hunt for our kind in schools. I just got off the phone with Silver. Apparently, some states are balking sending their daughters for testing lest the spree attack them on their way into the building. Okay. Have you briefed President Wade about what happened in India? Apparently, she's still under the weather. But please, get the vice president up to speed. Suspicious. Is one of ours. We'll take whatever allies we can get. Take the spree. Uh, civilian. Oh, wow! They look so good! I think it looks fine. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to borrow a Ooh, Look at her hair! Anacostia's hair! Yes. Go off! You need that coat, too. Gosh, she looks so good. Amazing yourself. Hi. Oh, okay. Trigger treat, Justine. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't have any candy. All I have are witch fingers. What are witch fingers? <laughs> <laughs> you ladies clean up nice. Bonnie, you're not coming? No, I'm I'm, I'm going to take Brianna trick or treating. Mom duties. <laughs> Mommy, can Tiffany come with us? Tiffany's oh. still on vacation, honey. Remember? Only one block, okay? I don't like this guy. He's, Shall we? He seems very controlling. Better than this cadet. Oh. Ah. Uh. I'm fine. He ran out of hand to hand. I've been attacked by the Camarilla twice. They killed General Sharma and possibly a Dylan Kalita, so. I feel like we've moved beyond sparring now, no? Well, we were thinking. Maybe we should both come home with you for break. Oh. You won't be safe there. We won't be safe anywhere. You can't think like that. We have fought them off before and we'll keep doing it for as long as it takes. The unit to have her back. What's going on? Oh, okay. Uh, 
Very witchy. Is the defending of the heart. Commodore Hastings and her troops were sequestered deep in the forest during winter. They couldn't light a fire without giving away their location. They decided to light one, and it proved fatal. Every saw and since the regiment wanders these very woods, desperate to extinguish the flame. It's our job to stop them and keep the fire burning until the last stroke of midnight. Oh, wow. What happens if you win? What happens if you lose? You get to speak to the dead witch of your choosing. Oh. From the lost regiment? From anywhere. Ooh! What happens if they lose, though? What happens if they lose? Ooh, yes! Back to Anacostia and Tilla. Yeah, we love that, we love that! A duo that we love. We oh. can't use any work. And we'll improvise. Ladies. Kind of cost you the hair, man. Cavalry. They take care of their own. Investment funds, private schools, real estate. Plenty of cops and judges in their pocket. Thanks for including us. It's not a lot of familiar faces in the movement here. How'd you get all this? I did provide a little gift. Did he bring a witch? Man, they're going right into the wearing a mask. How are you going to take the exarch's face? Huh? They're going right into the lion's den. They can't use work. Oh, I'm worried about them. If we make it to midnight, who are you gonna talk to? They'll seem to be less than the lions that there's no shortage of people to talk to on a night like tonight. Cool. What if Rayel would like talk to her mom? What about you, Rael? My mom? Oh fuck! She's not even dead! Okay. I caught it. Okay. Whoa. Oh god, it's the, the freaking the string instrument! Oh, this guy with a red mask. Ladies and gentlemen, may I have your attention? Oh, he Thanks. looks like a bad guy. From the testing center. Guess we found our mark. Yeah, now we just had to figure out how to get close to him. Quick. I've asked the staff to arrive a little bit later tonight so that we can start this party with a bang. Tonight we will be reinstating a long-held ritual performed by our ancestors on All Hallows Eve. Oof. 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 Oof
he seems to well he seems to care a lot about the unit especially like abigail and tally um i don't know it's really nice to see a male witch uh it's just it's nice it's just different and the Camarilla are changing their their tactics like all they said in the last episode but to bring a kid into it a kid that's fucked up and for the the guy i don't i don't remember his name because i don't even remember him but i can't believe he brought his daughter's friend to this he kidnapped her i mean he kidnapped her what the fuck that's that's so wrong on so many levels God damn it. Oh my god, and between this <sighs> Fuck this episode so intense. Oh my god. <laughs> wow, so much happened in like two seconds. <laughs> oh freaking Scylla coming through, man, and Anacostia. <sighs> okay. Oh my god. <sighs> I'm like, I have tears in my eyes. I can't. It's too much. This show keeps getting better and better, guys. <sighs> Just saying. Tell and Gregorio, maybe? You light your candle. Say the name of the witch you want to speak with. Everybody gets to. That's cool. As the wax melts, your messenger will be freed and will bring forth your requested dead thing. What if Tally... How long do we have? What if Tally told Sinecta? The burns out. Did she say she was going to talk to Nick? I think I talked over that. That doesn't seem long enough. Never is. I told her she said hi. Give her my best. There's so many things I could ask her about, you know? Like 
the, the, the last thing she said to me before she left, or, or the letter she left me, it's just like, I don't even know where to start now. You'll know when you see her. If you see her, I thought as the audience, like, you're not going to be able to tell your mom because she's not dead. Oh my gosh, she's going to be so sad. Okay, interesting, interesting place, Telly. Well, I'm calling. I'm going to ask her Bellwether. Oh, she's still going to show Bell. Oh. Where have to be spiders? Oh god, we're getting ghosts in Mother Level State of Now. Oh. Just go, just go. Oh, why the candle's already like halfway? I want Abdel to get closer with Charvel. Maybe, maybe she can get This is not helping. I know. I should have been there to save you. I live with it every day. And it's just this pain. You didn't fail me. You failed yourself. Oh, I think that's, that's kind of worse. No, no, it's not. Is this what she finds out that her mom's not dead? Why did you murder yourself? Lies. You think I did this? My choice. <laughs> My brothers and sisters, General Alden's army is here. There's no sugar coating with Chavel. <laughs> I'm fine. The fuck? <laughs> well, well, is is Rial gonna like put two and two together and find out that her mom's not actually dead? Man, I did not expect to cry this episode. <sighs> fuck. Everyone's like shit after that night. <laughs> You know, I've gone over the conversation in my head so many times. And I thought about what I'd say to her and, and how I'd say it and 
what she'd say back and how she'd probably tell me I needed a haircut. <laughs> Why did she come? Because she's alive. Why didn't she want to talk to me? I need to go back on break. I need to see my dad. Charvel sent me straight. I need to get back to being me. I need to find the people who took her voice and get it back and bathe in their blood. Oh. Tell me. Because even if you do manage to She's find fine. them, you're basically just <laughs> offering yourself up. Think about what you're saying. You're right. The dude's okay, right? <laughs> Tell you. The dude's alright. What is it? It's about a deal. You better be okay! It's fine! Thank god she didn't lose her boyfriend too. I haven't stopped shaking since Cynthia. Hey, you made it out. That's what's important. I know they've come for your family before. And they try it again. Being hunted gives you a unique perspective on survival. Doesn't it? Time to make them feel hunted. Uh, we start with the one who kept Sherman. Are they gonna work together now? Oh, okay. <sighs> she forgot her favorite pencil. Is she gonna kill him? <laughs> are you sure that's all you want? <laughs> I had a feeling. I was like, don't <laughs> underestimate her. <laughs> Tiffany is still not in school. You don't think something bad happened to her, do you? Of course not. One less witch in the world. What if she was a witch? Not our daughters. Oh! Bro, I kind of like saw that coming. When she walked into the room, I was like... Oh, is that just Scylla? Okay. more I mean I come I mean she I mean she straight up killed him and I'm not saying that death is good but he, he, uh I don't know he kind of deserved it I mean no one deserves to die but now I'm conflicted and now I'm now I feel very conflicted Justine I didn't know you were coming over today uh yeah I was just dropping something off for Shane have a coffee with me I can't today I'm sorry next time there won't be a next time. I'm sorry. Find something to live for. Something that's beautiful and real. Otherwise, hate is gonna eat you whole. Wow. Okay. Um that was even more intense than the last episode. Not as intense like shit's about to hit the fan but like the stakes were higher in this episode the stakes were higher for Scylla and Anna Costia. I'm not saying I'm not it was satisfying to see Scylla kill the guy but also I'm it's it's really it's confronting to see her actually kill him and we can really see that she has changed from season one she's a little more soft and I think we're able to relate with her more because because she is a little more humane. Like that speech she gave Bonnie at the end where she told her to find something good because obviously her husband was not that. He was very controlling. In a ideal world, it would have been better for him to just leave. But the fact that she killed him... I don't know, I feel a little conflicted. Just a little bit. Yeah, okay, that was really intense. I, I'm excited for the next episode as well. Like always, there's a lot. <sighs> okay, I... There's... I'm going to take a break now because that was a lot. Thank you for watching my reaction video today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought in the comments below and stay safe and hydrate. I'll see you guys for the next episode. Bye!